Not, we didn't get a lot that spawned in here, but that's okay. This this wave should go fairly quickly, I would like to think. Another plus nine. Oh, we're up to two hundred seedlings. I didn't I didn't expect that to see that, so that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. So we do have that as a plus. Yo, 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 everybody, what's going on? It's Lodi here back with another Nordic Ashes run. If you guys do end up enjoying, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. And if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Every little bit counts, and I do greatly appreciate it. It helps the channel out a lot. And also, you guys can press that bell notification to get notified when a new video goes live as I do upload every single day and you guys don't want to miss out without further ado let's jump right on into this if you guys didn't miss the last one this one we are running axel door but like i said if you missed the last one make sure you guys go and check it out as uh yeah it's 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 been a good one um i believe we ran this one in the last one i'm tempted to try the the hammer this run just because um it was pretty crazy in the last one um but i also like stormbringer man maybe maybe we'll just stick with stormbringer um yeah let's, let's stick with stormbringer stormbringer is always gnarly and this is the second one of svelte time so we're almost to jotunheim which is pretty pretty cool yeah the relic exchanger over here i thought i saw it in the last episode so yeah we can um it looks like throw these in for 150 but we definitely don't have the seedlings to do that so we're of course not going to do that um have I okay yeah we have not ran hard mode so we'll try it out see how this goes it shouldn't be too bad I don't think so hopefully it goes swimmingly and uh, we should be able to make some pretty good progress I think having area on this one as well could be pretty crazy um just to try and juice up having the biggest axes of all could be could be wild so maybe we'll look into doing something like that as well but Let's uh, let's get this show on the road. I do want to roll. I mean, area duration kind of sucks. Area cooldown, projectiles duration. Eh. I definitely want the projectiles. That's for sure. Duration, not so much. Um, I'll definitely take that one too. Okay. Of course, the more the more projectiles we can have, the better off we'll be. With um, especially with the axes. Um, not the greatest there, but I'll take it. Cause why not? Um, can make we can make use of it um seedlings of course i want okay we're all out of blue hearts we gotta be careful here um not too too worried but it is something we have to be aware of i forgot that when we dash we do explode things so that's that's good there um, i'm gonna make my way over this direction we should be able to yeah there we go okay there we go the attack speed's a little slow Okay, paralyzed, then we get uh, something here. Cool. Um, cooldown projectiles, area damage, sure. Projectiles, duration. I don't want duration. I'll take cooldown projectiles. Projectiles, area. I'll take damage and projectiles right off the gate. I'll definitely take that. That is absolutely huge. So I'll take both of those. Um, we're looking pretty good here. Um, of course, damage probably would have been pretty good to get as well. But hey, that's, that's you, you win some, you lose some. It's not the end of the world there. So that's all right. But we are doing pretty good. Can't complain here. Give us something good up here. I mean, burn enemies. Have a. I mean, we're not really going burn, but I'll take it just in case we get some items to burn. Um, but I, I, don't, I don't think we're going to take anything that takes burn damage. Unless we get a load of XP and then we just stack up on, like, all the skills that we can have. Because we could get the, the brand boots. Um, but... I probably won't, but you never know. If we get enough XP, maybe we can just max everything out like we did with Chaos, but who knows? We'll see, though. We'll see. Anything Anything can happen in these runs, so hopefully we uh, it'll be in our favor, hopefully. I'm going to run down here and get this Ascension Crystal before it gets any later in this run. Uh, as it is still, I mean, we still are at the start of Wave 2, so nothing nothing too crazy, but I still don't want to forget it, because picking it up early definitely helps us out. It does look like we got damage and movement speed altars, so that's not uh, too bad. Shrines, monoliths, whatever you want to call them. I still don't really know what to call them yet, um, but it doesn't hurt uh, picking them up. So. 
Uh, we'll run over to... We got this guy up here. Let's run up to this guy first, and then we'll run over to the gold mine, probably, and then down to the gold uh, altar monolith as well. So, pick you up, and since we're inverted, I'll run up here. Okay, we got you. Dash over. What do we got? Poison mushroom? Okay, I'll take that. That's not, that's not too terrible. That is not too terrible. Area on the axis is not bad either. Definitely definitely need to juice up attack speed though. Attack speed is definitely just a wee bit slow. Um, we are taking a little more damage than usual, but hey, that's a okay. We might be able to take the, the moose this time instead of the bear and really juice up our attack speed, but or not attack speed, uh, damage. But I think we're doing okay for damage. I don't think I don't think it's the end of the world. I don't think we really need to need to force damage down our throat quite yet. So we're doing pretty good there. We'll see though. Things could easily change, um, but like I said, I think we're doing pretty good. Nothing, nothing too to worry about at the moment, I don't think. So I do want to try and get still as many seedlings as possible since we are spending them at the end of this episode. So if you guys want to see what we spend them on, make sure you guys stick to the end of the episode. We'll see. <clears throat> we'll see what we can get. Hopefully we can get some, some good stuff, max out some things, you never know. So, we are up to 14 points. Let's spend some of these guys. Let's definitely get this damage up to 35. Not a whole lot of damage, but that's okay. Cooldown will be pretty good as well. Um, oh, we could also max this out. Shooting axes. Let's do the lightning one first. We'll get this, and uh, yeah, we should be pretty good here. Shouldn't, shouldn't have too much to worry about. Okay. I may take the... Dang, we're getting a lot of lightning bolts stuff. So maybe I'll max out the lightning next, but I don't think the lightning um, the thunder armor, I don't think it's super, super good. I think we did do a thunder armor run before, but I don't think it was like anything crazy. <clears throat> but it does paralyze, which helps with that one item that we picked up. So we, we'll see, we'll see. Once again, just hunting for seedlings, nothing too crazy there. Just running a boot. Alright, not bad, not bad, not bad. Looks good. Oh, more seedlings. Okay. I mean, we're at a pretty good spot. Oh, this guy's new. I don't think I've seen this guy before. So he was new. I honestly don't think I've ever seen him before, so... Interesting. I mean, we're doing good. I I, I don't think we're, we're struggling at all. I mean, XP can be a little more exponential, like we could get a little more of that, but once again, it's not the end of the world. We're still doing pretty good there. So, can't complain there. Okay, not bad. Looking good. Come down here, pick up this box, see what we got going on here. Alright. Okay. Okay, yeah, we're looking... Once again, we're looking pretty good. I'm, I'm not really seeing any issues or anything with us possibly dying. Um, those are new. Who spawned those in? Oh, it's this guy. He's the one that spawned it in. Okay, well, we'll wipe him out real quickly. No, don't get... Okay. But oh, we're doing no damage to this guy, which is a little worrisome. Let's grab this. I'm gonna grab this one instead, and then we'll juice up the uh, damage here. Um, and attack speed as well. Okay. We're not doing really... Oh yeah, that feels good. The attack speed feels way better. Still not really doing much damage. The attack speed is slow though, man. In between... Uh, in between uh, attacks. Like the cooldown needs to be higher. That's, that's the word I was looking for. Ooh, he has the same... Interesting. He has the same ability as the rat. We need to heal. Let's 
steel. Okay, okay, we killed it. Woo! We're getting low there. A little started started to scare me a little bit. Oh, uh, 80 gold, not bad. I'll take this. Ooh, as much as I would love that, I'm gonna hold off. Cooldown, we definitely need to juice up. Um, it restores a red heart, sure. Blue heart, maybe. Cooldown, yes. I'll take this as well. Um, area could be good. Attack speed. On oh, my rocket, yeah, attack speed could be good. Uh, let's see. Crit, maybe. Projectile speed is a yes. Plus one damage could work as well. Uh, crit, we only have five of, so I guess I'll take 2%. I mean, it's not a huge, huge increase. Duration, I don't think it is really worth it. But, um, sure, I'll take it, I guess. Why not? Why not? Uh, we'll max you out. We'll come here. We'll get you. We'll throw you on there. We'll grab you this as well. Uh, I do want to try and get up to projectile speed, I think, as well. Just to max out projectile speed, I think that'll be very useful. So I'm going to do that as well, and hopefully, uh, hopefully it goes in a good direction. Uh, we are already sitting at... Um, we are already sitting at... 60 seedlings which isn't i don't think it's too bad i think though before first boss i usually want to aim to try and hit uh like 100 150 if that's even a, if, if that's even possible because i think the amount that i'm kind of leaning towards or hunting for let's make our way up here and see what this guy has for us hopefully something good i do like the green fire that's pretty cool two empty red heart containers uh that's not too bad i guess i guess i'll take that I mean, more hearts, the merrier, because, like, we like taking damage here. Especially on Axeldor. Axeldor, I feel like I always take damage. Like, it's hard for me just not to take damage on Axeldor, so. But not the end of the world, that's okay. I'll take the damage. I will take the damage. But we're looking pretty good. Okay. Not bad. Yeah, I mean, we're looking, like, like once again, this is just like every other run. Like, it's, it's, it's just smooth sailing. Like, we, no issues or anything like that. We have all the, not all the characters. We just have the, uh, basically the Ice Queen left, which we'll actually get in Jotunheim. We'll get her in Jotunheim by getting one. All we need is one white, or white, one Ice Heart, and we'll unlock, we'll unlock her. So that'll be pretty cool. And then it's going to, uh... Finding the last statue piece, I think, in, in Nottenheim or whatever. So, we're looking we're looking pretty good. Two characters left now, not, not too terrible. Uh, we are making progress through the islands, though, doing this, uh, like, round-robin style uh, videos. So, we're good. We're looking good there. Uh, next will be Thyra, which, uh... Fire is always a good one to play, especially if we run Poison Bomb again or something. I don't know. I don't know if we're gonna necessarily run Poison Bomb. We might do. Uh, we might do arrows. That, eh, we ran arrows not long ago. I feel like maybe maybe we'll run. Hmm. I mean, we could run arrows. We could run po double poison again. Double poison is always a fun one. Uh, we could run daggers. We might run. We actually might run daggers on Thyra. We'll, we'll just have to see how things go, though. I don't know. I don't know. Poison and lightning, sure. We are poisoning a little bit. Might as well take it, because now it'll also do lightning damage. So why not? Ooh, we got a lot of stuff coming in over here. I'm going to run down here and try and pick up all this XP, because that's a lot of XP right there. Lots of XP. And I love me some XP with, uh, with these runs. So we're looking pretty good. We're up to two two blue hearts so not not nothing nothing too terrible there we're not getting a lot of gold this run at the moment we are halfway through we are sitting at uh 30 32 gold so nothing too crazy we do have the xp ring though so that'll definitely boost up our uh our uh skill points there so i'm not too too worried about that all right i mean we, we're looking good we're looking good once again 110 seedlings not too terrible i think if we can get 200 
Like 200 a run, I think, is what we should kind of look for. I think 200 a run would be very, uh, very satisfying to uh, help us out a lot. So, we'll see about that. We'll see about that. But yeah, hopefully y'all have been enjoying the content. Once again, if so, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Every little bit counts, and uh, I do greatly appreciate it as we're helping the channel grow. Helps the channel get recommended to other people who may also enjoy the content. Um, and working our way towards that 1,000 subscribers. So, join the join the family if you guys are, are new to it, new to the channel. Um, I, I greatly appreciate it. Um, couldn't say my thanks uh, more. And then also, if you guys uh, would like... You guys can tap that bell notification to get notified when a new video goes live, as I do upload every single day and you guys don't want to miss out uh, on new content that comes to the channel, such as if it's still Nordic Ashes or any other new uh, new games coming to the channel. I do have some series I plan on finishing here, hopefully in the next couple of weeks. I don't know necessarily about finishing, but definitely uh, getting back into uploading them to work towards uh, completing as well, such as like Zombie Survivors and stuff like that, and Deep Rock Galactic, since they had that major update not too long ago probably about a month now uh, at the time of recording this so we definitely definitely got some some games to go to they're all those two are very similar to this kind of game so swarm like game so definitely uh, if you guys are enjoying this one make sure you guys definitely check those out as well there's also playlists on the channel i think both the playlists have around like 30 40 videos in them so definitely go make sure you guys check them out um you guys will also end up enjoying them because there are some crazy broken builds in uh, those videos as well all right, sweet. So we're still looking good so far. I mean, uh, I, I think Stormbringer is probably one of the... I think Stormbringer is fun to play. I do want to do a double a double hammer build. I don't think we've done double hammer yet. I'm pretty sure we have not done that. So I definitely want to do that. Um, either if we can get double hammer in chaos or missing, I'll run double hammer. If not, we'll run double hammer on the next axle door. For sure. This is definitely very slow. Okay. Ooh, that's a new one. I've never seen double before. You gonna pick that up? Okay, there you go. Uh, Get in there, kill him. Yeah, baby. That's what I'm talking about. 37 XP points. Holy crap. Are we over 40? Eh, not quite. Definitely take the 50 gold. Oh, we lost out on like 10 there, I think. It's a bit of a bummer. Attack speed, projectile. Okay. Uh, area could be cool. Crit, maybe. Duration, we don't really need. Uh, area, of course. Um, damage, attack speed. More cooldown wouldn't be bad. Force cooldown. Uh, we'll reroll again. Damage. There's 5% crit. Maybe, 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 maybe. Yeah, let's take it. Roll, and we don't have enough to roll. Um, maybe I'll take a... I don't really want any of that, you know. So let's come over here. What do I want? Hmm. You know what? I think I'm gonna go into this, and then we're gonna level it up. Leave the fire behind it. All right, cool. Let's uh, let's head on out and see what we got going on here. Shouldn't be too bad. Oh yeah, look at that, baby. Look at how long the trail goes. Holy smokes. I wonder if that's duration that makes it go super far. What is our duration? 35? I mean, I don't think it would make it go that far. Huh. Interesting. Oh, we got this. Every blue... What plus one blue heart. Sorry, I yawned there. 25% damage while you have at least one blue heart. And we have two, so we could take it. Maybe I will. Maybe I will. Then all we have left is the gold mine, so... Not, we didn't get a lot that spawned in here, but that's okay. This, this wave should go fairly quickly, I would like to think. 
five plus nine. Oh, well, we're up to two hundred seedlings. I didn't, I didn't expect that to see that. So that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. So we do have that as a plus. Yeah, this is like just another walk in the park. Nothing to really worry too much about here. So. Another walk in the park. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy here. Do gotta be careful of that boss up there though. So, might as well go up there and just kill him before he pops any, any funny business on us. Oh, well, we're doing pretty good. Not much to worry about at the moment. Okay. Looks like we got those points. Might as well spend it on this because, like, we, we're going to have a blue heart as, as long as we heal. As long as we pick up potion, we'll have a blue heart. So I definitely want to make sure we at least pick it up. At least we'll pick it up. All right. I mean, we're looking good. Once again, walk in the park. We're playing Thyra next episode. Then uh, I believe it's back to Apgrim, Helga, and whatnot. Um, those guys are going to be fun. Uh, I believe we're still in uh, Spalthopheim on them guys. So no, no new island quite yet, but we are. Uh, we're definitely working toward a new island here soon. So looking good still. Um, once again, if you guys want me to just upload expert runs only let me know down in the comments as i've just been uploading everything as you guys can see uh normal hard expert i've been uploading it all but if you guys just want to see expert runs let me know down in the comments and i can do that because at this rate we're going to have close to i think 400 videos um so just let me know and i can do just the expert runs on the channel also um i can go back and just play the normal and hard runs in my own time to work towards getting all the achievements so if you guys just want to see the expert runs let me know and i can i can go back and just i can just do expert runs only rather than constantly running all these other um difficulties so we're not just uploading nordic ashes but that's completely up to you guys um i do see you guys are enjoying and loving the content so i'll just keep doing it until you guys uh want to see just uh, the expert runs or if you guys want to see something else um, like I said I do plan on getting I know I've been saying it for a few videos now I do plan on getting back into some other series here but I've just been enjoying this one it's once again it's easy to record it's fun to play so I'm not I'm not like super stressed out on content or anything like I just enjoy playing this one so just because once again it's it's easy to play and it's it's actually kind of enjoyable and fun so uh, we'll come up here. We'll get uh, this. I'll take 5% movement speed. That's not too bad. I'll grab, let's see, more area. We could take crit and movement speed, but I'm not going to worry too much about that. Crit again, duration. Eh. Let's grab you. I mean, area, projectile speed, 5% damage isn't too bad. So I'll take that. Um, ooh, I don't really care about duration and all that. So I'll roll once more. Bounce, ooh, that would be huge, but I'll take the two area, which bumps us up to 80% area, which is not too bad at all. Um, I might max out the movement speed here, but I do want to max this out real quickly. Okay, and then we'll throw some points into this guy as well. Maybe we'll throw some points into this guy too. Yeah, it doesn't look too shabby. All right. Well, let's jump right on into this and hopefully smoke this guy pretty quickly. Sindri sh shouldn't have too much of a chance, but we are on hard mode. Oh, there's broke two. There's two bosses in this one. Interesting. There's two bosses in this mode. Um, Sindri's down and broke is down or Boke is down. Okay. I was not expecting to see two bosses in a run, but we beat hard mode. Sindri's axe and uh, hard mode or higher. Okay, so we unlocked that weapon. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah, I was not expecting to see two bosses there, but we, we smoked them with absolutely no problems at all. Uh, so let's jump over here. We'll spend that. Uh, we we're only get, able to get one leave, so we're up to 32 leaves. How much does this cost? 10, 5. Duration we don't really need, but 
maybe we'll still take it. Um, five, we'll take you. 10% um, chance to get gold. XP attraction, I'll take. Uh, starting gold we could go for. We really probably should save up for this, um, if anything. Increase the number of dashes. We don't necessarily need at the moment. We'll take this as well. We're down to five. So each time you earn gold from any source, you'll have a 10% chance to gain one extra gold. Okay. Um, or we have item attraction as well as crit, rerolls, poison, chest rerolls, effect prop, burn damage. I think I'm going to go for ultimate cooldown for that one. But that's been all of our um, stuff. I don't know if we'll be able to actually get all of them considering uh, the slots and stuff up here that you can change between. But we're not going to worry about that. But once again, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. This has been Nordic Ashes, and hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace out.